you know, what's going on here. Today I'm making, well, obviously these are spring rolls, but they are paleo, keto, and whole30 and comes with two dipping sauce, Chinese dumpling dipping sauce, and then also a Thai no peanut, peanut sauce. Want to learn how to make this egg rolls paleo, whole30, keto friendly, and also low carb? By the way, it tastes amazing. Keep on watching. Here are all the veggies that will go inside of our spring roll. As you can see, it's mainly veggie focused, so it will give us a lot of color and also crunch. Bean sprouts, cabbage, carrots, shiitake, and also scallions. This is optional. It's important that when you shred the veggies, you use a mandolin slicer instead of a cheese grater because you want to keep the ingredients dry, otherwise your spring rolls are going to be soggy. So this is perfect, not that. To add extra protein and flavor, here I'm going to use ground chicken breast, not chicken thigh, because ground chicken breast will give you less moisture. Again, it will help the spring roll keep crispy. Also some grated ginger and garlic. And this is a wrap I'm going to use. It's Paleo Whole 30 Keto and also free of wheat and gluten soy. I will put a link in my recipe link description so you can find it online too. It's very good. First, we're going to saute the mushrooms with some avocado oil and season with a little bit salt. Saute until they turn a little bit softer. Set the mushrooms aside. Next, we saute our veggies. Also season with another pinch of salt. So saute the veggie for about two minutes and then also transfer to a bowl with the mushrooms. And you can see the veggies are still vibrant and crunchy, but just slightly softer. And we're gonna set them aside that they cool. So next we're gonna cook the meat. Now you can see I start the skillet dry and I add more oil. And now I'm gonna add half pound of ground chicken breast. Next I'm gonna add grated ginger and garlic, some salt, and some coconut aminos. If you're not sure what coconut amino is, it's a soy sauce substitute. Uh, you can find more information on my YouTube channel. And just keep sauteing until you, see you, you want to break the meat to like small, fine pieces. Gorgeous looking already. Now we add the ground meat to our sauteed veggies. We're gonna season with a little bit toasted sesame oil. If you can have sesame oil, you can just use extra virgin olive oil. And don't forget about our chopped green scallions. This alone, you can enjoy it even without the wrap. This will be the most authentic egg roll in a bowl. But now we're gonna combine them together, put it into our coconut wraps. So it's important that we don't overfill our wrap, otherwise it would be hard to roll. So this coconut wrap is seven by seven inch. It's a square shape. So here I add about three tablespoons of the filling and now we're just gonna roll. So bring the button up and then slide it in. Make it as tight as you can. Put the stuffing in there. Do your best. And now we're gonna roll a little bit up. Now we're gonna close the side. You can make adjustments. See, there's no filling coming out of here. It's very important. We're gonna do the same thing for the flip side, for the, the, the other side, I'm sorry. So look at that. It's tight, right? And then I'm just gonna keep on rolling. So when we come to the top, this triangle shape here, we're gonna dab with water, just a little bit. So this will help us like seal the wrap, almost like you're sealing an envelope, just like that. And place them sin side down and over a large sheet pan like this. And then I'm just covering them up with some wrap, so this way we'll keep the um, coconut wrap moist so they won't get too dry. I'm gonna work on the rest of them. Just lightly brush with a little bit avocado oil, not too much, just want to give them a little bit color in the oven. Voila, this is the finishing product. I made two different dipping sauces. This is my Thai no peanut, peanut dressing, and this is my paleo dumpling dipping sauce. They're both really, really good. So I'm gonna take this one, and I'm gonna dip that in my Thai no peanut. 
peanut sauce. Oh, this is so good. Let's eat. Mmm. Guys, you have to try both dipping sauce, especially the Chinese dumpling dipping sauce one. It's going off the roof. It's so good. And I love this coconut wrap because they give a light sweetness and it's a healthy, it's low carb. It's absolutely delicious. That filling inside, it's so many veggies and it's just crunchy. It's so good. So if you're watching this on Instagram, you know what to do. Watching this on YouTube, click the link in the description box below. Again, my name is Chiyo Smith from iHeartUmami.com. I will see you here again very soon. Thanks for watching.